The boy had to endure the pain of pulling out a dragon horn every day to save himself, just so he wouldn't be tormented to death by the noise coming from it. At first, his grandmother was afraid to let the villagers know about her unusual grandson until the whole village started losing their hearing. It was then that she realized the severity of the situation. The village elder searched far and wide for renowned doctors and finally managed to bring Ginkgo to help. Ginkgo believed that all the answers were hidden within the ears. By observing their internal structure, the form of the insect creature would have nowhere to hide. Sure enough, upon seeing the mucus in the villagers' ears, Ginkgo understood that their voices had been devoured by a creature known as Ko. These creatures resembled coiled snails and liked to hide in the darkness. As soon as they heard the cochlea that could collect sounds, they would abandon their shells and take up residence within the human cochlea, devouring all the sounds. Ginkgo instructed the villagers to bring hot water and add a packet of magical edible salt to it. Finally, they just needed to pour the salt water into their ears, and the insects would come out on their own. And miraculously, the man's hearing was restored. Following Ginkgo's method, the deafness among the villagers disappeared completely. However, no matter how the boy tried, he couldn't regain his hearing. Helpless, his grandmother shared the boy's situation with Ginkgo. He was the most severe case among them, and his symptoms weren't the so-called deafness. On the contrary, 